Hello, welcome to Joyful Angel Oracle. I am Angel Leah Joy. Thank you for joining me. The choices for the individualized oracle offering. Smile. Yes, you can. Align. Today, we'll be calling the Enchanted Map and the Wisdom of the Hidden Realms Oracles, as offered by Colette Baron reed At this time, I'll open with the invocation. You can, if you'd like, set your intention and focus your awareness. I ask the divine energy of love that permeates the universe and bonds all in one to guide each of us seeking into the highest truth we are ready and willing to understand and so it is thank you smile Yes, align, and the wisdom of the hidden realms, I ask the divine energy of love that permeates the universe and bonds all in one to guide each of us seeking <laughs> into the highest truth we are ready and willing to understand. We'll begin with the Enchanted Map Oracle in the smile position. <laughs> and here we have number 33, Peaks of Joy. Your life is filled with happiness, so share it with others. Colette has recorded... Joy is yours today. No matter what your inquiry, you will be happy with the results. You're coming closer to a sense of achievement, and you've worked hard for it. You're surrounded by true companions and events that are synchronistically arranged to bring you to the next level of your life. The world is singing a beautiful harmony. Life is exhilarating and hopeful. Let gratitude fill your heart and remember to share your happiness. Joy is contagious. And the wisdom of the hidden realms brings us the spiral dancer. Serticutus route perception Number five. The spiral dancer moves with her own rhythm and steps to music only she can hear. She takes you on a path that is winding and circular. She assures you that what you're experiencing as a setback is really part of an upward spiral. Perception is everything. You're not retracing your steps or going backward, but rather around and up. She says that you can be comforted, knowing that your path is one of success, adventure, and experience. 
follow her, for she dances along a magical way. If you're asking about a relationship, keep on dancing, and magic will soon happen. Also, it's okay to allow someone else to take the lead at this time. Make sure to let others know that you're open. Always remember that relationships are mirrors and will show you the past, the present, and the potential future. All relationships have a destiny. Each is a sacred teacher with valuable lessons to share. Even if it appears that the two of you are dancing in different directions, all the steps are perfect, even when you may seem to be stumbling. The spiral dancer is a reminder that destiny's true path is seldom straight. <laughs> Yes, you can. The Enchanted Map Oracle offers Rock Bottom Number 10 Surrender and acceptance are the keys to freedom. Colette has recorded for the upright position as difficult as it may be to accept, it seems you've reached a point where you can go no further in the same manner in which you've been doing things. Perhaps you've hit the proverbial brick wall or experienced a deep sense of loss and don't know where to turn. The old way of doing things must be discarded fully in order to move onward and upward. A new direction and a new strategy are called for. The only way out is through surrender. Accept things as they are and admit that you have no idea what to do next. If you wait in that heartfelt moment of release, a stairway will appear and all manner of synchronicities will show you the way to higher ground. The rock bottom card is a sign that a miracle is about to occur, but only if you let go completely. The wisdom of the hidden realms brings us in support. The winged wise ones, number 34, Angelic help and miraculous aid. <clears throat> Always allies and never challengers, the winged wise ones represent the aid of all the angels. When you enter their realm, Know that your sincere prayers will be answered according to the will of the divine. This also represents divine intervention and the potential of miracles to heal and transform as if by magic. Have faith, whatever your circumstances, heavenly beings are watching over you. The winged wise ones give you a glimpse of the future by offering messages whispered on the wind. These are translated within you as inspired thought, instantly unraveling the past and revealing the present. Be aware of the higher consciousness in you. This is a good time to observe your thoughts through meditation. Who is observing those thoughts? That self is kin to the winged wise ones who have come to help you soar. Ooh. Thank you. For a line the enchanted map offers number 45, 
sad embrace. Loss is a part of life. Let go and allow time to heal you. Colette has recorded for the upright position. You may be entering into a period where loss is a theme. Perhaps you're having to let go of a long-cherished dream. If so, take heart, for this ending may have been for your highest good. A better and more powerful dream will be realized in your life if you can accept the loss. Relationships based on faulty foundations are meant to end at this time. If your expectations aren't met, a sense of loss arises along with grief and sadness. Express these emotions. Tears are like healing rain that can restore life to a parched inner landscape. Growth is always assured. Whatever the loss, however great it is, let go and experience your feelings so that you may soon see what beauty lies ahead. And the Wisdom of the Hidden Realms Oracle offers in support Number 14 The Hungry Ghosts Obsessions Scarcity Consciousness Attachment When the hungry ghosts appear on your path, they may not at first seem like allies because they represent your constant focus on the past and the consuming desire to know the future, which rob you of your true present. But in fact, they are here in the service of alerting you to observe thinking and addictions. They're masters at magnifying repetitive behaviors. The message is for you to examine whether you're doing the same thing over and over while expecting a different result. This time will be different, and I have control over this, are false statements and a sign of a deep denial of the truth. Now is the time to let go of that thinking, surrender your will, your life, your heart's desires, and all that pains you to the divine. Order will be restored to your life. The hungry ghosts also bring understanding about the distractions of life that seduce you into forgetting what you really desire. They're asking you to become aware that what others want and what the culture dictates will make you happy may not be what's best for you. Don't get caught up in outside appearances. All that glitters may not be gold, at least not for you. Look beyond the veneer and you will find the true substance in your life. You deserve nothing less. Growth is not always comfortable. It is all not always a neat and tidy process. But if you can fully engage in the entirety of the journey and allow yourself the opportunity to feel your emotions, whether they bring sadness or joy, they are all necessary for your journey, for your development, for your awareness. Today is a day to really open your heart and your journey. To dare believe that you can be more than where you are, what you've ever dreamed of, reach higher. Believe you can. Be well. Enjoy your day. I will join you again tomorrow.